All right, everybody. We are, what day is it today? Let me check. It is May 17th, Tuesday at my demolition project, or I should call it my renovation project. And, you know, May 17th, this is about two weeks in, I'd say. Um, and, you know, we started this job um, with uh, everything, you know, up. And if you've been watching the the you know the the days and the episodes of this project you'll see what i'm talking about um but yeah we today we demoed the sink we threw out a bunch of garbage again you know what i didn't know about a renovation project is i would say at least 40 percent of the work is garbage like you know 60 to 70 percent of the work is actual skill right where you're you know putting in plywood or you know you're actually demoing and there's a skill of demoing you're not just taking the hammer and just going like crazy because if you do that you're you're, you're gonna waste a lot of energy but um you know that's why actually a, a lot of the demo work i didn't do because i'm not very skillful at that so instead uh where i could be very helpful is i could just throw out garbage because you know throwing out garbage anyone can do uh, and, and anyone can do efficiently as well so um you know, I was just helping the, the skilled workers throw out some garbage. Um, so yeah, we, we, we got that done. We removed the sink. We threw out a whole garage full of garbage. Um, we, uh, we, there's the, yeah, the basement sink's gone. We, we demoed more insulation. Uh, we did some measurements for, um, you know, kind of planning how the bedrooms are going to be, um, and, and doing a little bit of changes and, uh, yeah, so anyways, I'm going to show you exactly what we're going to look at and how much work I did today. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. All right. So you can see here. So we did throw a bunch of garbage, but because that garbage bin is full, we had to stack more garbage in the garage for now. All right, actually, I'm just going to go through the garage and kind of see everything's opened and torn down the roof and everything see i did a lot of cleaning i vacuumed here got the plywood in today um really interesting actually so we bought um so the engineer is actually here and we were discussing floor plan revisions so this spot right here we were thinking of really putting a laundry here right so you can see that we've made the room here for the washroom so this washroom here is going to be an ensuite washroom coming straight from this bedroom this used to be a door going this way right to go out but now we put it into an ensuite washroom we wanted the laundry here but it wasn't deep enough. We weren't, and so we had to actually move it, and now this is gonna be a closet. Right? Um, over here, he, this this used to be a linen closet coming out. But you can see right now, we've extended the closet. So it used to be like, there used to be a stud here, but we tore that down, and now this is a bigger closet. This linen closet? This one, I rolled that off. This is the bed, uh, the third bedroom. This, this thing, I opened it. There hasn't really been any changes here. Closet, bedroom, all, everything stays the same. We are planning to add a washroom right here, and we're blocking off this this stairwell to the basement. So we're gonna have actually have two completely separate units who have no access to each other um, because we're doing this for rental purposes. The kitchen's going there and this is gonna be the living room. We're actually knocking down this wall and most likely gonna put in an island. But you know, as, as things go by, things can change. Um, all right, let's head to the backyard. So the backyard, we haven't done anything. It really has uh, it looks exactly the same, so there's nothing uh, really to do or to say. We might do some landscaping, but since it's for rental purposes, very un very unlikely that we would do it. Um, but we'll see. So over here, we had a lot of insulation up here, so 
we kind of threw away a bunch of insulation. Um, last time we were here, actually all this was demoed. Uh, the fireplace was demoed, everything was demoed. So, um, you know, not much change in the basement, I'd say. Um, other than, like I said, we removed the washroom and we, oh yeah, we removed the washroom too. So this sink, this used to be the laundry sink. You know, those white ones that are very old. Yep. Um, this used to be a big washroom. So we took down the frame completely. Um, actually me and Buddy were speaking today about how we plan to lay this one out. Uh, so the washer dryer is most likely going to be right here now, right? We're going to add a wall and you know, it was, it was actually really uh, interesting this part because I was worried the bathtub didn't have enough depth when, uh, you know, you can see that this is not very wide between this stud and this stud. It's not very wide. It's probably only 24 inches. And uh, he, he wanted to put a bathtub here. So I was really worried that like you can't. And, uh, but what he said is we can actually add more depth here, make the door smaller. And we can add more depth here to make this door smaller. So either way, we can add on both sides. So that's why it's going to work for the depth of the bathtub. Um, you're going to have a sink there and a, no, sorry, it's a double vanity. It's a double, no, sorry, it's, it's washer dryer because you have 60 inches. Then you got the double vanity and then you got the, the toilet and uh, the bathtub. This, okay, this laundry, right, it's going to go there. Um, this bedroom, there's actually, we're planning to add a wall right here. We're planning to add a wall, okay. So th this is going to be a hallway exactly where I'm standing, and it's going to go straight into this furnace. So this is going to be its own room, this furnace room. But the bedroom itself is going to go from all the way to this wall over here to the washroom. And right, imagine there's going to be a wall there. So this is going to be a bedroom itself. Okay, this over here is gonna be a bedroom, right? That right there. This, we, we are, we're, we're doing the kitchen right here. You can see the dishwasher is gonna go like that. This is gonna be the sink. And then this is going to be the, um, the oven and then the fridge. So you have the simplest kitchen already able to be in this line of kitchen right there, this this framing, which is actually pretty perfect. I really like that. Um, I was actually asking if we can make it even further, but uh, you know, Buddy said like the plumbing and the, the HVAC and stuff, it, it, it has to go somewhere. So they're gonna put it in the corner. Plus they also need the structural uh, support to support the stairs, so. I'm actually thinking that we add a pantry and maybe even an island for the tenant. Um, and this is going to be one big living room. And as you can see, right, as I walk up the stairs, you have access to the garage or you have access to the back door. Um, and, if he, and if I close that wall off the, to the upstairs unit, then it's completely separate units.